Well, good Monday, folks. It was another hot one out there. High temperatures today made their way back into the mid-90s. A little bit more humidity, but still on the tolerable side of things. Feeling close to 95 to about 100. We'll have one more day of that for your Tuesday, then some relief. We'll finally arrive in the form of daily chances of showers and thunderstorms as we get towards your Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Not a washout by any means, but the showers and thunderstorms will be there. And that's because that high pressure system that you see to our south, that's going to slide off the coast. And that's going to open the door for a large cold frontal boundary, which will stall across the region, giving us those continued chances for showers and storms. It all starts tomorrow, isolated in coverage, kind of similar to what we're going to see out there this evening where most locations are dry. Some get a quick moving shower or thunderstorm and that should be about it through the early evening and early overnight period. Things die down during the nighttime hours and then they refire again. Wednesday though should be better coverage wise because that frontal boundary will be closer to the area. 70 in Parkton, 69 in Westminster, starry moonlit skies but staying pretty muggy out there, very uncomfortable during the overnight hours. Bright start to the day tomorrow, hot and humid in the afternoon, high temps back around 95, 96 degrees, 95 in Frederick, 96 in Baltimore, 92 in Annapolis, 86 even there in Ocean City, no relief. And the coast Wednesday, better chances for showers and storms to show up. High temperatures right around the 90 degree mark, if not below that with the extra cloud cover in the skies above. We'll cool it down again on Thursday, a little less on the storms. Same thing Friday and Saturday, better chances for showers and storms. And then we're back towards 90 degrees by the time we get towards the beginning of next week. Remember, you can download our free mobile app at WMAR2 News, available at the Apple and Google Play Store. Just search it. It is free. Also, look us up at WMAR2News.com, Facebook, and Twitter for the latest weather and news updates. I'm meteorologist Eric Taylor.